Welcome to Psychological Take on the News. I am Dr. Bandy Lee, public health psychiatrist. Donald Trump's administration is finally allowing a transition to the Biden administration to proceed, although he has yet to concede. Today, we will discuss what the major news programs are missing, that is the psychological aspects. The last three weeks should have shown that election results, the law and democracy itself are not set in stone but are rational constructs that we as a society have agreed upon. These require mental health to operate and must have the consent of the collective mind. Many are relieved that our legal system is working, but it is working because of our use of it. I have tried to explain that prosecution and constitutional measures can also be a means for behavioral limit setting and not to give up give up in advance because of their unlikeliness to succeed. To do so is to surrender the most decisive battleground, which is the battleground of the mind. We must remember that Donald Trump's real goals were not to win lawsuits, but to sow enough doubt so that he could move on to the next steps, which are to subvert reality. This is why I explain in my Profile of the Nation the importance of care of the self. It helps you to ground yourself in reality. You become part of a life-affirming impulse that coalesces into a powerful collective when everyone does it. The law did not save us. We did it through collective action and first through voting and then through uh, our steadfastness in supporting the law. So please keep up this essential work. Consult us at dangerouscase.org at bandylee.com and read my Profile of a Nation. Our next steps are in it. Thank you.